Yo friends, we're going to check out the engraving speed of the Lumi Tool F20. So I'm sure you've seen lots of ads on Facebook and other places showing, oh look on how ungodly fast it is. Um, a lot, pretty much all of those have been shown in time lapse and you don't really get a sense of how fast it really is unless you just swallow in blind faith. So we're going to see what that really looks like. So we are in the Lumi Tool app we're going to take one of their stock plt formatted vectors but i'm going to show you exactly what they do to make it look like it's awesome and stupid fast so we are running at a spacing of 0 0.0432 millimeters which is the equivalent of 600 dpi which is the maximum engraving quality this can do so let's do an apply. Now, as for what we're filling here, um, your guess is as good as mine, usually. I've done this out a few times, as you can tell, so I had to figure out what does fill one and fill two mean. Um, keep wheel, first wheel, no idea, honestly. That's just how this app is. But let's see. Right now, we're going to run at 7,000 millimeters per second, 50% power. This is roughly 45 by 50 millimeters, the equivalent of, say, 2 inches by 2 inches. So nothing particularly great. So let's do a preview, make sure it's all lined up. All right, you can see the preview there, no problem. Now, we are already behind safety shielding. I'm going to kick the exhaust on so it's going to be a little loud. Um, but the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to show you just what they'd like you to see in pretty much every video I've seen online for this machine so far. One second, let's kick the fume extraction on so that I'm not breathing in crap. All right, it's firing up, so we're gonna hit print. Yeah, that's like lightning fast, and if you zoom in, if you look really, really, really closely, you can see what's there. All it did was do the outline. And, well, that's great, but not a lot of people use it that way. I mean, that's really just drawing lines and there's nothing special. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back and we're gonna do an actual fill on this, like the examples above. Same parameters, 0.432. 7,000 millimeters a second, 50% power, ready, go. Now ah, yeah, you gotta wait for it to send it over to the machine. A little bit longer than you know, what you might be expecting. All right, now it's started engraving. Let's see how we go. Well, one thing is pretty clear already, and is that it's not nearly as fast as you've probably seen in all the other advertising or from the other influencers that have been putting out videos. But no, this is its maximum speed. Still going. We're about one third there and one minute in. And I'm sure somebody's still probably going to ask, well, why don't you do it with less resolution? You know, lower your DPI. Won't that work? You know, it might actually work and it would technically speed things up. Um, I'll save that for another video. Um, I do find it interesting that the Lumi Tool app will not let you engrave anything over 600 dpi. So most fiber lasers have a spot size of around 0.02 um, when properly focused. 
So that's roughly one half of what we're currently set to. In other words, this is kind of going two times as fast um, compared to those, but the resolution isn't equal. And Lumen Tool is being you know, limiting you to no, it's got to be this big. So it is going to be a question of just how big is the laser spot on this machine. Um, six is it, is it actually around 0 0.04 um, millimeters in size? Is it actually a little bit bigger? Um, I do know that running at a spacing of one millimeter, you can definitely see some gaps. They're not huge, but you can actually see them uh, with the naked eye. We'll kind of run through later on and figure what that is um, to see what realistically you're looking at. All right, we are what? We need to almost two thirds done and almost two minutes in. Again, this is a relatively small fill. This is only about two inches by two inches. Um, this is using their artwork, their app, and their settings for maximum resolution. I don't know about you, but uh, I'm starting to get tired. Oh, here we go. We're, we're almost there, almost there. Closing in on the three minute mark if I'm watching my recording correctly. If not, forgive me. All right, there we go, now we're done. Oh, you'll get to see is another little funky thing. Um, which I found with the Lumi tool and its app. Um, you'll notice that it's still kind of sort of going through with that red line there, um, out, doing another outline. And the only way to actually stop that from doing it is to do a preview. And then say stop. You'll notice, I'm not sure if you can actually see that. The preview is not actually exactly where it engraved. So, that's another thing. But anyway, that'll give you an idea of a realistic speed of engraving with this machine. Hope this helps.